Well, there's a potential new alternative treatment for people with rheumatoid arthritis, an often debilitating condition. Health reporter Stephanie Stahl has more on the new research. Dawn Steiner has rheumatoid arthritis, an autoimmune disease that can affect the whole body, causing pain and swelling. Out of nowhere, feeling as though I had been hit by a truck. Steiner says she couldn't raise her arms, move her shoulders, brush her teeth, or even shower. I wouldn't wish it on my worst enemy. She says more than eight medications didn't work, and she spent months trying new prescriptions. And they have all had horrifying side effects. In 2023, Steiner enrolled in a clinical trial, researching something called vagus nerve stimulation, where patients have a computer chip implanted into their necks. Simply put, by driving electrical signals down the vagus nerve into the immune system, it's possible to stop inflammation, and that's what the chip does. Doctors say as many as 50% of patients like Steiner aren't getting enough relief from the medications available, which is why there is so much hope for the chip. The FDA, as we speak, is now considering what, whether or not to approve this therapy for use in the United States. Steiner says within a week of the implant being turned on, she was already feeling some relief. Now, two years post-surgery, Steiner says her life is the best it's been in 15 years. This has completely changed my life. The research showed that the nerve stimulation worked for about half of the patients who tried it, and because it is not yet FDA approved, the therapy is not widely available. I'm Stephanie Stahl, CBS News, Philadelphia.